Hey, hey, in this video, we are going to be setting up the propeller adds traffic source in the binome tracker. Let's get started. Um, inside of your binome tracker, navigate to the traffic sources tab. Click create, type a name. You can use the templates if you would like, but I find that many times that they're outdated, so it's better to just do it manually and find the tokens yourself. So we have propeller ads, the postback URL. We need to get this from inside of our propeller ads account. So you can get that by going into your account, clicking on tracking, and this will be your postback URL that you should use. So I already have that here copied. So let's paste that in and you know that the right tokens are in when these turn dark gray. If they're not dark gray like this, then you, the tokens are not correct. So you always will need to pass back the external ID, which is propeller ads click ID and the payout if you want to see your ROI inside of the traffic source. The postback URL in your traffic source is completely optional. Um, if you want to see the conversions on the traffic source, then obviously you have to add a postback URL. In the advanced settings, you want to always tick the use tokens. This will let you use 10 different tokens, which are uh, the tokens from the traffic source. Many times traffic sources have more than 10 tokens, so you need to figure out exactly which 10 you want to use because you can only use 10. You can find propeller ads tokens inside of a uh, a campaign create a new campaign and right by where you put the campaign URL in your campaign setup you'll find all of the tokens um, many traffic sources will have the tokens available inside a knowledge base documentation as well so let's start with the external ID You can put whatever you want for the parameter. The placeholder must be a traffic source token, however. And the name, you can put whatever you want as well. This will be the name that shows up in your uh, reporting. So I'm just going to call it what it is. can again name the parameter whatever you want this will be what shows up into in your campaign URL and once you've typed in all of your tokens um, verify look over that they're correct and click Save the traffic source has been added and we can use that in our campaign creation which we'll show in a later video